derivation of position velocity relation by graphical method. Draw a velocity time graph where the body moves with initial velocity u, final velocity v, time taken t, and uniform acceleration a. Since it is a position velocity relation, we will convert t into the other factors. We already know from velocity time relation v is equal to u plus at. Hence, to get t out of it, at is equal to v minus u and t is equal to v minus u by a. Keep this as equation number 1. Now, when we draw the velocity time graph, Now, when we see from the graph, u initial velocity is nothing but OA and v final velocity is BC and time taken T is OC. Since we need to find out the position, let's say distance travelled by the body in this situation is as we see from the graph, the area covered by the line AB with time axis is a trapezium. So, the distance traveled by the body is area of trapezium OABC, which can be given as half into sum of the parallel sides, which is OA plus BC into height OC. We know OA is U and BC is V and OC is T, which is equation number 2. So, putting equation 1 in equation 2, we get distance travelled S is equal to half into U plus V into v minus u a which is v square minus u square by 2a in other words 2a s is equal to v square minus u square so the position velocity relationship is 2a s is equal to v square minus u square this is called third equation of motion. So, v square minus u square is equal to a s is called third equation of motion.